Next up on Halifred Art, we have Sekanoid. Uh, I think that's how you say it. Sekanoid! I have a, uh, also I have a discount code and link for people. Charm Plays, all caps. Use the link in the description for those on YouTube. And you get a 10% off, so if you like the game, just keep that in mind. There's apparently two games here. We got Sekanoid and we got Yucatron. I don't really know the differences. Also, these games contain flashing images that could potentially trigger seizures for people with photosensitive epilepsy. Like, seriously, the entire thing flashes all the time, and there's no option to change it. So, if you suffer from epilepsy, please do not watch this stream segment. With that said, let's begin. With Secondoid. You know, I should probably use my... Can I use my controller? I can use my controller. Excellent. Too bad my controller's A button's getting sticky again, but whatever. So what is Secondoid? Well, it's this. You can shoot in any direction. So it's basically a twin-stick shooter. That's a non-traditional twin-stick shooter. Do I have a map? No. Okay. Oh no. I didn't even see that. Bad skills. First of many. Well. I wonder, actually. Let me try something. What happens if I go down? How did I do it the first time? I, I don't... I, a bullet got me. It's not here. Hmm. Oh, I can't open this. I wasn't aware. Ah, I see. I was worried about that happening. Precision. Small capsules are hot points. Big capsules give me speed ups. I don't know, I thought I might be able to just go through that. Oh shit. My bolts are very tiny, I can barely see them. I'm fighting off hamburgers, guys. There we go. Oh, I got a double shot. Now I can kind of see them. Oh, let's shoot off bullets. I just realized those mine shoot off bullets hexagonally. Break these apparently. Put it out. Oh, oh this is all hurt me.
play it safe. I, sh I do realize I can destroy their bullets, though. That's pretty handy. Okay. What? Sorry, that was very surprising. So it does seem like bolts are just generally destructible. It's good to know. These only have points. I don't really know why I'm even bothering with them. Oh shit. <laughs> there's, a, there's a trap that. Okay, one, one thing I'm having problems with is during screen transitions, the game is just kind of mean. Sometimes. Also, I think it froze. No, never mind. Did, I don't know what happened there. So I don't know about- I don't know about this game over system, though. I wonder if there's checkpoints or saves anywhere. So this feels like a really- this feels like a game that would be fine if it wasn't, uh... Well, making me restart the whole thing if I run out of lives. This feels like a game that would be better just to have exploration be the focus. Also, yes, the turrets did fly under the rhythm. I noticed that, too. I don't blame you if you can't figure out what's happening, because the bolts are very small. I don't know what's happening here. Yeah, the game is not very good with the hazard, so when you use screen transition, you might just be at a spot. A bother. <laughs> Alright, I'll, I'll just move on then. Oh fuck. I can't believe I've done this. I lost it. Well, that's rude. I thought I was gonna shoot their shot, but I didn't shoot their shot, so... I got lucky there. Alright, 
So this is where I died last time. I see why. Remember, these mines shoot, uh... Like that. That's how I died. Is there any reason to even go over there? No, not really. Oh wow, if I don't- if you shoot though, that keeps you alive. I have a double shot back, at least. XP? I don't know, maybe. Now, extra extra lives might come if I get... Actually, yeah, what do the sparkles give me? Give me two, they give me two uh, points. That's all I can tell. I don't know what the X is. Multiplier. Okay. It's up here. So that, doesn't, that doesn't look very fun. That doesn't look very fun at all. Alright. What? What killed me? Uh, wait, we want the other lasers to poke through? You know, this game's hard. It's kind of just like, there's no settings either. I don't feel like... Now, if this was like randomly generated levels, I maybe would be more chill about restarting, but... Restarting is just like, oh, okay, I guess I'll go through everything again. I don't know. It doesn't, it's not very enjoyable? I'm getting better, I guess. This is my last attempt, by the way. A little too monotonous to want to keep playing the same stuff over and over again. I don't feel like the game is terribly fair when you go through entrances. Like, look at how close I am to, like, hazards upon spying this room. I feel like you spawn into the room a little too far. So that mine, by the way, can kill me right off the bat. I can shoot bullets, but if I'm lined up improperly, it doesn't actually work. So it's best to be not too reliable and relying on that. Yeah, I don't know what the multiplier does, really. I'm being cautious with it. Best thing to do on, the, on a lot of these screens is just back up immediately in case there's something blowing up on you. Okay, 
There we go. Like that. Where is this? That's going to be my new strategy. When I hear three, I'm just going to back up. It's not really well designed. Was that? Was that good? I had trouble telling. Extra life. Oh. You know, I just realized something. Green topping is actually a pretty efficient way to like cheese the game a bit. I have no problems doing this given the game's kind of unfair too. It seems like the damage saves, so. Shit, this goes to this room. I just like pass really fast. I get hit by the laser. It's gonna go, 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 go. Okay. Whoa, what the fuck is going on in this room? All right. Yeah. <sighs> These spawn points are fucking stupid. Damn it. Now I lost my power up, so that's great. Okay. I, I don't appreciate that level design at all. Fuck. And now I have no power ups, I'm like fucking weak. This game isn't well designed, is what I'm trying to say. I think so. I think there's just so many upgrades in then. What if I didn't have speed there? What in the fuck? Okay. No. Rather not. I don't know what the fuck, but no. Whoa! It's going like right there. How am I gonna... How am I gonna... They're in my way! <laughs> Hold on. Right there. I don't know, I just heard their like razor blade attack sound effect, and I was just worried. Wait, no, extra lives are just random things you get. God, are you kidding me? And I don't have enough time to go back to the power-up. 
I this is frustrating. It really is. Oh, that's cool. Excuse me. Wait, wait, I wasn't done with the first wave. That's fine, whatever. Okay, cool. Wow, this game sucks. <laughs> I mean, there's something to be said for difficulty, but this is unfairly set to put together. It says enemy enemy priors do not reset. Their positions are and such don't reset you. They can get literally. It's would be quite possible to get an enemy stuck within a warp point where so if you enter the screen, you just immediately take die. This is poorly designed. Let's. But this game does have two games. Maybe Yucatron is better. Oh my god, that's very flashy. Okay, Yucatron is the same game, except for in a context where it actually works. Like, this, see, now, now this is fine. Now it's just trying to be Robotron. This is, this is fine. Oh, that's bad. Okay. Right, this is still kind of unfair, but at least now it, it, it works with the game design. I'm sure those upgrades exist at Subler. Oh god. So this is actually, this is a proper arcade game. This is, there's no problem here. It's fucking hard, but this is hard, but reasonably designed. Because when you have everything taking place on one screen, well, it just gives you more room to react. It just gives you more time to react and more fairness to see what you're doing. Still though, it's not amazing. Neither of these games are amazing. It's a bit of a shame. Second Night could have been better, honestly, easily. It looked pretty good from uh, the videos I saw, but uh, on a screen by screen basis, it looked fine. But it put together as a whole package, Secondoid's not really that great. And Yugatron, I mean, it's cool. You got you got a good old, you know, you got a good old uh, Robotron clone. But you know, not ideal. This is a fairly mediocre set of games overall. Not wor not the worst. They control fine, but yeah. So that was Secondoid, and. Uh, it exists.